To enter Hits Radio Pride's Future Star competition this year, I decided to throw myself out of a plane. But I want to know, what's the craziest thing you've done for love, as a dare, or for money? Bungee jumped. Oh, that's pretty cool. Naked. Oh! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> it hurt. <laughs> oh! Oh, no! <laughs> uh, had my head shaved at uni for okay. money. Um, it was probably about, I think it was over a thousand quid that okay. people, at, people at uni paid to see my head get shaved. And wow. I was in my underwear on stage uh, in front of the whole student <laughs> union. So, um, yeah, it was many years ago. Uni challenges. Yeah. The craziest thing that you have done? It's better to don't answer. <laughs> that is an answer. <laughs> I was working as a waitress in 1987 for Peter Stringfellow. Okay. And he wanted me to jump out of an aeroplane for charity in a tutu, looking like that. Okay. And I totally wouldn't do it. <laughs> I've never done anything crazy. I'm a very uh, square person. <laughs> well, I like your glasses. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Oh, my God. I literally travelled to another country for love. Okay. And it went to sh like, I was there, and then I was like, mm, I'm not feeling it anymore. <laughs> which country? Uh, well, it was my own, which is pain. So okay. I just saw my friends. I'm partying instead, and I ghosted him. I blocked somebody 30 times on Instagram and then um, asked them to friend me back. The most craziest thing. So you blocked and then unblocked? Yeah, and I kept on doing it. I just wanted to peek and see what they were doing. <laughs> And then, and then I blocked their asses again because I was mad. And then I unblocked them. And I kept on doing it over and over. That is, when you look at it, the psychology behind it, you got to be f***ing nuts. Are they blocked now? Um, or are they unblocked? Let me check. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Take care. Thank you. When I was, like, a teenager, I used to have a pet tarantula. Okay. And it's so lesbian. Um <laughs> And as a dare, I thought it'd be funny to let loose in my parents' bedroom a hundred crickets. What? Yeah. <laughs> no! <laughs> and so my dad had to go around and hoover them up because they were making noises in the night. And like for like weeks afterwards, they would just find... Ooh! Yeah, that's Thank probably... You. Yeah. <laughs>